Welcome you all, here is Ken and Danny. Today we are uploading the GPX file, that's the file with the track I'm going to follow on my today's training, to the Mio Cyclo 505 HC device. It's easy, but you have to know a couple of things to do it very quickly and in a simple way. Uh, first off, unlike with the Garmin device, after connecting this one through the USB cable to your computer, you have to turn the device on. Uh, because uh, otherwise it will be only in the charging mode. So you turn it on. Uh, if it was already uh, on before connecting to the computer, it will ask you, uh, do you wanna uh, just charge the battery or connect to your PC? So then you choose the PC connection. Uh, that's it. Then your computer will actually find two different files. As you can see, Mio System D and Mio Data uh, F folder. Now, system, you don't want to be messing with the system stuff here, so uh, this folder with all those uh, folders here, like program files, uh, HDD and so on, you don't want to be doing anything here. All we need is the Mio data, because we are putting some data on your device, so it's easy. We open this one, then we have this uh, Dodge folder, open this one and then tracks. Easy, because we are actually uploading a track here. So what I'm what I'm gonna do is to copy the track to my device and the job is done. So it is easy, you just have to know uh, where to actually put it. Now let's just uh, close this one. I'm gonna remove my, uh, my computer from the computer, uh, my Mio from the computer and then I will show you um, how quick it is. Okay, I'm removing this one, okay. Now my device will uh, just start and I'll be able to find my track under the track icon. So it's gonna be super uh, easy. Uh, it's off right now, it takes just like 20 seconds or, or so uh, to uh, load those files once more. You can change the profile of your bike um, just on the way and all right now I'm here uh, it's already uh, loaded I'm going for Navi and tracks this one is in Polish but here you will you will see tracks I'm opening my tracks and I see the track I just uploaded that, that that's the first one uh, on the top then I can simply choose the track and the device will first navigate me to the track and then uh, navigate me through the track uh, so, so that I will be following exactly what's on, the, on this GPX file. That's it guys, thanks for watching. Uh, give me some more comments uh, on maybe perhaps like similar devices, how do you do it so that all those searching for uploading GPX to your uh, bicycle device will have even more, more info. Give me also some thumbs up and I will see you soon, bye bye.